Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if your mouse cursor is having issues with your dual monitor setup on your Windows 11 computer. So if you're unable to actually move your mouse properly or it's not going in the direction you were hoping it was, so maybe it's kind of going off the screen. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve that without too much of a hassle. And we're going to go ahead and jump straight into it. So first thing I recommend doing would be to open up the search menu, type in settings, best result should come back with settings, go ahead and open that up. You want to select the display button. If you have your dual monitor hooked up, if you're going underneath multiple displays, there would be an option to switch monitor 1 and 2. So you may have monitor 2 selected, but you want that as your primary monitor. You just would swap it with the other ones, you just would drag it over to the left side to make it 1 or 2. And you can also drag the windows up or down to orient them better to your screen settings. So definitely something you guys would want to consider looking into there. You can also remember where Windows locations are based on the monitor connection and minimize Windows when a monitor is disconnected. So close out of here. Something else you can try here too if you open up the search menu again, type in control panel. Best result should come back with control panel. Go ahead and open that up. So your view by two large icons and then you want to select mouse. So at this point, you can adjust different mouse settings, such as your double-click speed, swapping your primary and secondary buttons up here as well. And go to pointers, adjust the pointer size, as well as how quick you want it to move around the screen. So generally speaking, these are some additional settings you can take a look at as well. But pretty straightforward process, guys. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.